Hi, I'm Nora, and today I'm going to be putting together some more outfits, mainly because I just made a purchase and it is so gorgeous and I love it so much. So I want to style it in a bunch of different ways. The most beautiful thing is this cardigan, which it doesn't look like much, but trust me, it is. It's also a little fuzzy, but it's got like ruffles and it's like a ruffly cardigan. <laughs> and it's all the way down it gets such a nice shape so excited to wear this because i swear you are not going to be able to pry me out of this cardigan i have multiple ways i want to wear it one is i want to wear it in some sort of victorian christmas themed situation i don't know then i want to style it in more of a fall direction because that's actually why i bought it because my friend kate is having a fall themed tea party so i thought this would be perfect and now i want to style it for that um also i am wearing something under the robe it's just a nightgown though slay slay for fall i love the little black dress kind of thing i really love the little black dress now i only really have like a really thin slip dress which it's not the most I don't know, warm. Also, my nails, they are the cutest color. My nails are the cutest color, but it's been like five days since I painted them. And these, these ones already came off. What is that about? I, I swear I'm not doing anything mysterious. They just peel. I don't know. Okay, hold on. My hip is, it, it's, it's going out. Oh no, my hip is giving up on me. I this, there we go. This is my little black dress. It has little slits up the side. Oh, I have tights downstairs that I just recently got. My mom bought them for me. <laughs> They're like, they have stars on them. I'll go grab them. Stay here, I'll go grab them. Okay, these are the two options. This one's really hairy, I don't know why, but it's stars. I love these, they're the little stars, so cute. But I had two options, and out of the two, I think these might just be better for the theme that we're going for. Because they're like a beautiful floral. I got sunburnt this summer, obviously. I mean, look, I'm as white as a ghost. But I got sunburnt this summer, and for the first time, I got sunburnt through my fishnets. And so did my friend, Kate. She got really badly sunburnt through her fishnets. But I seriously, like I had snake scales on my leg. It didn't last for long, but I was really annoyed. Oh, I'm putting on fishnets right now. That's why I'm hunched over. Look, I swear there's more of my leg. I'm not showing you my crotch. Now we gotta put on this. Okay, it looks good. I'm kind of cold right now because the ceiling fan's on. Hush. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Oh, let me fix the ruffles real quick. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. With the fishnets too. I wear some knee high boots with this. Maybe even like platform knee high boots. I love sweaters. I have sweaters here. I have sweaters here. I have sweaters on my body. I love sweaters. They're so comfy. Okay, here is this shirt. Um, it is Edwardian inspired. I made it, so don't be sure on the shirt because you'll hurt my feelings. <laughs> Two gorgeous buttons, big billowy sleeves, which I was worried about. Used to be a bed sheet. I made my sister's bed sheet into, she doesn't use top sheets. Weird. I use top sheets, which honestly though, a lot of people have said that they don't use top sheets. Do you use top sheets or no? Because I use top sheets because I can't stand like to feel certain my certain blankets. Like I have one that kind of feels like that Sherpa texture. I can't I can't stand that being like on my skin. So I have to use a top sheet. Now behind this tripod is a bucket of laundry that I have not yet put away. So that's what I keep going and grabbing. So here is the skirt. It's just plain. It's got this gorgeous pattern on it. Skulls and crossbones. But it's got like pleats in the back. And that's the back zipper. 
it's really pretty it's got nice pleats i just have to steam it or iron it because it is very much wrinkled and i think i might need like some sort of like petticoat some sort of something i'm gonna wear this underneath it just to see if i can give it some a little poof because this is my poofiest thing okay this is the shirt on um now i did not go by a pattern which is why it's uneven i literally just I, I whipped something up. I literally taped pieces of paper together just so that I could draw a pattern and then not really even follow it because everything came out uneven. So, um, we got the skirt on, we got this on, we're gonna put on this. Not bad, okay. It looks not bad at all right now, okay? This is genuinely cute. I'm gonna have to actually make my own petticoat, which is disappointing because I really wished that I didn't have to make yet another thing the shirt is laying flat the neck is a little uneven okay oh my gosh it's beautiful okay the neck is uh, bugging me a little so i'll have to like fix that maybe with um ironing it might look better it's beautiful i love it I don't know how the shoulder, like, I don't know what I would do with my hair, like, if I'd leave it down, or if I'd, like, put it in some sort of, like, big Victorian hairstyle, but look at how gorgeous. Like, I thought that the ruffles were gonna kind of distract from this area, but I think it kind of adds to it. I feel so proper. It's so preppy in here. No, stop. Uh, I, I need to stop saying that. I also love wearing long dresses in the winter because it completely hides my hideous snow boots. They're, they're warm, they're useful, they're amazing at repelling water, but man are they ugly. I am insanely hungry right now because I forgot to get breakfast. And this is working up a sweat. Let me tell you that, this is working up a sweat. But I think this is so cute. What do you guys think? Which outfit was cuter to you? The fall outfit or the winter Victorian outfit? Why did I do three fingers? There was only two options. I don't know. I feel like dresses seem super formal, but if you but if I wear pants, I feel like everybody's staring at me and they know I don't normally wear pants, so they're laughing at me. Oh! I left on my fishnets. So I have a decent idea. This dress. I never wear this dress. We're gonna put on her. She's cute. And I think she'd look cute with like a little bag and my shoes, so. But this is as good as I'm gonna get because I have very little time left. It's still very hot outside. I still don't have a lot of time left and I still need to go make myself breakfast. So, um, I guess we're stuck with this and my socks. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Um, I'm really excited for winter time and fall time and doing all sorts of different outfits and really expressing myself this uh, coming up seasons because I thought I was gonna be so happy this summer and then the heat wave. Oh my gosh, it was so bad. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. I really hope you liked one of the outfits I put on today. Because if not, I really don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I'm sorry. But thank you so much for watching. And goodbye. <laughs>